again YouTube. Today we're heading out to Belchertown for um, 2017 Honda Civic. Brakes all the way around. I'm gonna pretty much just zip through this one. Uh, I'll stop, give you a couple of little highlights here and there. Sweet looking little ride. This might just turn into a we'll have to come back later because uh, I'm not prepared to get those lug nuts off without destroying them. And it's about 25 minutes or so, going on almost half an hour. The uh, owner went and get himself uh, another adapter for his custom lug nuts. And uh, Assuming he gets the right key when he gets back here, we'll be getting right into that brake job. Well, comes back with a set with a seven tine socket, seven tine, seven spline, something like that. Put it on there, and feels a little kind of snug, and then I realize something just doesn't feel quite right. I'll take a look. Really really close look and the lug nuts are six spline so that's a that's a split socket waiting to happen so he's going to uh, contact another shop nearby and see if maybe they have one of those uh, six spline sockets well, now he's out on trip number two he's heading uh, two towns away go to another shop and 
pick up one of the uh, lug nut adapters there. So we've been kind of sitting around for about an hour already. So what do you do when you got an hour plus of just sitting around? YouTube videos, why not? Okay, so the parking brake is not set. Now we're going to retract the piston. System selection, uh, ABS. Okay, uh, see special function, brake pad maintenance. Enter brake pad mode. Parking brake is released. Vehicle is stopped. Voltage is over 10. Go ahead. Now you can go ahead and push that caliper piston back. And then we'll put it back into that mode when we're done. for us to be able to push that piston all the way back in. You have two little caps. And pop them out. Then you grab the torques. Get in from the back side of these. Get that top bolt out of there.
bottom one also. Remove these clips right here just by pulling out on one side. back here very 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 carefully we don't want to damage anything take note of the spring on the in inboard the outboard doesn't have anything on it there's also a squealer on the inboard it's always on the leading edge a 17 millimeter Yeah, it looks like it, but it's not. <laughs> this is the base model LX. Gotcha.
This will just keep it from rusting up, or at least help keep it from rusting up, slow it down. Now what I have here specifically, a couple of different kinds of brake pads. You know, one's got it on this end, one's got a squealer on the other end. So these are going to be your inboard. You just need to figure out which one is going to be which. In front of the vehicles that way, so the leading edge is down here on the bottom. It's going to be fitting in from this side. So this is through over on this side. That one goes to the other side. Both of your outboards are exactly the same, so they don't make any difference. They give you an extra one of these. You don't really need it on this design. I only had it on the inboard, so I think you can skip this one. Put the caliper back over it. clean silver glide to these. So they slide in and out just a little easier. Same thing on the other one. Tighten your pins back up. And your two little black caps. Put them back in place. And when you got both sides done, go ahead and take the uh, parking brake out of service brake mode.
passenger side wasn't nearly as stuck as the driver side was. Now I got both of the back ones done. Start migrating towards the front. That'll be in part two. So if you like this video, remember, please like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to ring that bell if you're on a computer. quick footnote that when you're using the scan tool to put the parking brake into brake maintenance mode make sure that you have your parking brake actually turned off otherwise the tool will fail uh, and you'll end up chasing yourself around in circles trying to figure out why it's not working clear any codes if they're in there make sure the parking brake is turned off and you'll, as you can see, everything will uh, work as it is intended. <laughs>